couple years ago, I was really committed to giving my advanced students last year the opportunity to, to create a mural. When the conversation with MSA came up, instead of me just coming in and painting a mural, what if we could actually teach the students um, about how to design a mural and how can we turn this into more of a kind of a learning experience for the kids. So the mural concept that we pitched um, was essentially an abstract landscape um, of the hills behind the school. And most of them had never painted with spray paint before so um, we went out to the wall, sort of showed them a couple techniques and things that they could experiment with and then he was like go. At first I let them just kind of go wild and do their own thing and what I tried to do was get them wherever they were in their class and what they were currently working on to try to do that on a wall at a large scale. At the end of the every day we would we would step back and we'd look at the piece from different perspectives as a group and then I would raise the question what's our next step? I would only take them so far and I wanted to open the conversation of where do you guys want to go? From really far back, it looks like a landscape. But when you get closer and closer and closer, you, you notice these little tiny details. It's this sort of interweaving of everybody's culture and everybody's ideas and everybody's differences and weaving them together to create one piece of art that reads as uh, a whole. There's different perspectives to the mural, and um, I'd invite people and encourage them to just go up close, walk the mural, and really get a, a sense for how much went into it. And again, how much, when you, when you look at it in a smaller, more uh, micro perspective, you'll see the individual components. Do a little mural walk, you might get a little more appreciation for it. Thank you.